is our holiday gifting week, and today we've got the best toys for every kid on your list. So we're starting off with the hottest toys of the holiday season. Here to show us the must-haves, the Toy Insiders, Maddie Mahalik joins me in studio. Hi, Maddie. Hi, thanks for having me. Got a wild puppy over here. We're we'll getting get excited. Yeah, we'll get to him in just a second. Stay. Stay. Okay, first, what is the hot uh, toy this season? One of the hottest toys is actually Pomsies, and let's start off with them right now. Okay, they're So cute. these are interactive plush pets. They're inspired by the pom-pom fashion trend. So they're these little balls of fur, and they're so super cuddly, but they also have these very long tails. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Kids can, can show? Yeah, so okay. kids can wrap it around their... Oh my gosh. They can oh wrap gosh. it around their wrist, they can okay. put it on their hair, their See? backpack, and everything. Look, like, the, I love it. Yeah. Oh, how cute is very that? Cute. And then there's also Pomsy Poos available. They're smaller versions. They don't have the electronic features, so but they're cute. also super collectible. Very sweet. Okay, for all the Harry Potter fans in the country, I mean, yes. the movie just came out, and now we've got some wands we yeah. can all have. All kids can be wizards, so they can choose from a few different Harry Potter training wands. There's Harry Potter, of course, Dumbledore, and he who must not be named Lord <gasps> Voldemort. Seriously? <laughs> yes. Oh, that's cool. He's that one right there. So there's 11 spells for kids to master, then they will do the different movements, the wand will recognize the movements, and then we'll give them feedback whether they did the spell correct or not. No way. Yes. That's so yep. cool. Very fun. Maddie, I mean like Lego yes. uh, has really upped its game with this it doesn't like, get roller more, coaster. Right. Doesn't get more classic than Lego. And this is the Lego Creator Pirate Roller Coaster set. So there's 900, 923 pieces for kids to build this awesome set. There's three different configurations they can build, or they can, of course, use their imaginations to make whatever they want. I hear that, and, and a, I hear 923 yeah. things I can yeah. lose <laughs> as a parent. Yes. This is super cool, though. Yes. Yeah, that'll take them a couple Tons weeks to build. This little guy just wants all the attention. Yes, this um, is my puppy, Ricky, the real trick loving pup. So this is a bit of a splurge for families. It is. Yeah. It's $160, but he's very clever, and he loves to show off different tricks. So Aww. let's see if he'll catch his bone in his mouth. What? Good boy! Good boy! <laughs> oh yeah. my gosh, my real dog can't even do right? that. And then let's give him a treat, because okay. he's such a good boy. <laughs> okay, but here's the thing. You give him the treats, Maddie, and they got to come out the other end. Yeah, they poop. He they, has to poop on demand. They poop. <laughs> okay, we're going to leave it on the pooping note, and we're going to send you, Maddie, over to Anne-Marie, who yes. has our next set of toys. Uh, a lot of these are board games, and we are big board game yes. players at our house. I love it, but it's always a challenge to find one that everybody wants to participate yeah, it's in. it's such a great way to get the whole family involved, and mm -hmm. these are all under $25. So you oh, have to so break good. the bank to have so much fun. Okay. All right, so this is What's That Smell? And this is going to put your nose to the test. Okay. So there's these different cards, and players are going to try to guess what's on their different cards. Okay. Let's see what smells we have. Okay. So do not open. Release smell here. Ooh. What it's harder it? than you think. I so know. I think grapes. Oh. I, got I am right. It's yes. grapes. Correct. I got pineapples. And then if you get the most right in that round, then you are the nose at all. And that's important because then you get to choose a player who has to do a whiff of shame. Ooh, okay, what's yeah. in the whiff of and shame? And these are disgusting flavors like... Chunky vomit. Chunky Hot vomit. Chunky vomit. My son will love this. Diaper blowout. You do not want to get these <laughs> cards to smell. Trust me. This one looks like a lot of fun. Yeah. Okay, I have been playing with this in the studio for the last half hour. Yes. If you have tactile, kid, tactile kids in your household, this is so good. Yeah, so that's playful. It's super addicting. And kids are going to use it in Sculpt the Palooza. Yeah. Players are going to draw different cards and then... Based on whatever card they draw, they're going to try to sculpt different so, things using that play foam. This is so yeah. satisfying. You might have to do it with your eyes closed, with a friend. There's a bunch of different challenges. Look, look. But it's so Ooh, addicting. So good. <laughs> okay, now this one I have not seen before. Yes. It looks like fun, so but I'm going to try. Was, it's a way to play with your food with this one. This is Chow Crown, and I'm going to crown you the Chow, Chow Crown champion. Oh, so I'm going to turn this on. And then you're gonna try to catch the snacks in your mouth without using your hands. <laughs> and the camera's gonna move in different directions. A little, it's, a bit, <laughs> it's a bit challenging. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> okay. And it's okay. a lot of fun. Oh, you almost got it! Oh, yeah. She got a Swedish fish. Perfect. Chow crown queen. <laughs> I love it. That one was a lot of fun. Okay, and then this last one. And here we have Yeti Set Go, where every player is a different piece of player of a Yeti. They're gonna kick their meatballs into the snow mountain. Whoever kicks their meatballs first wins. Oh. Yep. It looks easy, but it actually takes a lot of skill to get your meatballs outside of your section oh. and into the mountain. This is fun. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much. I'm going to send you over to Bentho. All I'm right. going to try to oh. chow crown some. Yeah. <laughs> Indeed. All right. Well, these are all toys that allow parents reliving their own childhoods. Let's take a look at all these. Yes. Are you feeling nostalgic I yet? I am. A, every, it's it's a, like, like fashion. Toys apparently are cyclical. Absolutely. So Polly Pocket is back, and she's just like we remember. This is the Polly Pocket Big World Assortment, and it comes in different compacts like 
Um, there's a flamingo version, there's a cake one. So it's tons of fun. They have our micro dolls that we remember. So, so tiny. Oh, they are tiny. <laughs> oh, my daughter would love this stuff. Yes, and of course it folds up when playtime is over into a easy space. Fantastic. And then meanwhile, uh, uh, this is a new version of Pikachu I've yeah. never seen before. Yeah, you do not you need an introduction for this guy. So this is Power Action Pikachu. Kids can play with in all different ways. He'll respond to motions with lights and sounds. Really? Yeah, so oh. he looks just like he does in the animated series. Oh, fantastic. Now, I, oh, we've noticed this trend in video games where yes. old consoles are coming back miniaturized with all the games preloaded. Yes. And now we are at the point where it's time for the uh, Super Nintendo. Yeah, and all of a sudden it's the 90s again, right? Yeah. <laughs> so it looks nope. just like we did, it did when we were growing up, but it's bun very much smaller. Yeah. It fits in the palm of your hands. There's 21 games like Super Mario, Super punch out. Yes. There Boom. comes there's two controllers because you can't play by yourself. No. You have to play with a you friend. You gotta play with your yep. friend. Super fun. And then uh, then I am sorry, but this I this know. is this is this is gorgeous. What <laughs> am I looking at here? A blast from the past. This is arcade one-up cabinets. There's different ones that you can get. There's Asteroid, Street Fighter 2, Rampage, and Pac-Man. Really? Yes. So so this is just a this is an old so like a real arcade yes, game. Yes, it's a four foot tall cabinet. It has all the graphics and gameplay that you remember. It has Wait, it's got, all, it's got all these games on it? Yes. Uh -huh. Really? Here, do you want to give it a yeah, try? Yeah, I want to give it a Here. try. Let's turn them on. I mean, this is real. This is the real deal. Yes, then <gasps> you're going to move and turn with that. It has all the gameplay you remember, high definition graphics. And well, of course, I mean, not really high controls. definition. I mean, <laughs> this is a. Oh, I love this so much. I know. It's a great addition for any home or even a really I, I'm sure my, office. I'm sure my wife would love this in the living room. <laughs> right, in, right in there, Where right? am I looking here? Yeah. Where am I? Right here. Okay, Maddie, thank you so much. And for all the product information, you can head to our website, yourmorning.ca, and be sure to tune in tomorrow for the foodie gift guide. We'll be right back. <laughs>